What are we looking at, buddies? What is it you see? Oh, you got ducks! Huh? Is that what we got? Yeah, there's two of them. Mm-hmm. It's nice to see them in the backyard like that. Mm hmm. Hmm. It's been windy. Like, really windy. It's blown our chairs over. But you said it was nice today? Yeah, I ran out to check the mail earlier. It's nice. Is it cool? I feel like it would be cold because it's so windy. I mean, I didn't have a coat on and it was fine. Are they still there? Still there. You're just gonna like toss a piece of bread? <laughs> it's food. Oops. It's the heel. We weren't gonna eat it anyway. Oh, oh wait, is this food? Well, what do you say? This is food, Roger. Roger, this is food. That creature's throwing to- Oh, she's trying to hit me. This is assault. I'm leaving. <laughs> well, there's bread all over our backyard now, but they don't seem to be. <laughs> Maybe I should have thrown the bread. <laughs> and they're gone! <laughs> A little bit later, and it's time for us to be fed with second to last? There's two more. Third to last. Slow cooker meal. This one... I'm interested. I'm interested in figuring out what it's going to taste like, because it has not... It hasn't smelled great. This is called Sweet Fire Chicken. And it's... Chicken. It's chicken. And pineapple. And pineapple. And bell pepper. And bell pepper. And it, I don't know what else is in it. Sweet chili sauce. Something. It's got some flame in it. And it might be fine. It might be fine. It just... I really hope this is one of those instances where it tastes better than it smells. Because it, it, it actually don't... It doesn't smell bad, but it's, it, it's not... It's not uh, the most appetizing slash pleasant smell. So hopefully... Uh, hopefully it'll be good. I mean, it looks good. It's, it's the type of stuff I like. And hopefully it won't be too hot for you. I hope not. I mean, hopefully it won't be too hot for me either. So is that enough? Uh, yeah. Yeah. That's fine. There's more in there. There's a little bit. That's not a ton. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll eat on this and try to focus on the top part. Because I got rice in there. And then maybe I'll get a refill if I really like it. What do you think? different. So the good news <laughs> is that it, it, it tastes better than it smells. I think it's going to need some salt to bring out the flavors a little bit. Mm -hmm. But I mean it's good. You, it's really hard to go wrong with chicken in the slow cooker because it just becomes this melt in your mouth deliciousness. Um, the pineapple's the pineapple's good. It's sweet. It's very sweet. I mean, it was sweet when I cut it apart. Like it was a whole pineapple. Yeah. That I had done, and it, half one in this meal and half one in a different meal. Yeah. And like the raw pineapple is so sweet. It's. I mean, it's called sweet fire chicken. I don't really have the fire part of it. Like. It, it, well, there was supposed to be red pepper flakes, and I put some in. I remember, but I think I looked at it, and it was like. Add a lot Two more. Two whole teaspoons, and I was yeah, like, okay. mm, that's a lot. Okay. So if yeah. you want it to be a little hotter, you could probably grab some it's not, pepper it's, flakes. It's not bad. It, it's, it is very, it's very sweet. But mixed in with the rice and adding a little salt, I think it'll actually, it'll be pretty good. Not like the best one we've had, but not one of the worst ones. Um, that's reserved for the chicken and peas. The mush peas. Um, the final thing I wanted to talk about today is something I'm excited to own because I'm an adult and I get excited about things that are dumb. Uh, this thing, not the cat, um, who is just <laughs> going to town on himself there. Sorry that you have to see that. Let's just blur that out. Um, this thing, this is a uh, this is a new mat. It's called the Gorilla Grip, and um, it's gonna go into the laundry room. Uh, 
the laundry room is where we keep, and I think a lot of people probably keep their litter boxes. And the laundry room uh, is not carpeted as they normally aren't. We have linoleum in there. And uh, because of that, the cats use the litter box, jump out, and then that room is just a sea of cat litter on the floor. And uh, when I go in there to scoop the box, it gets stuck to my feet. Um, now, we had solved this problem by having a rug in there. We've actually had a rug in there for a long time, but um, back in like November, uh, whenever Kep peed down the side of the wall, you may recall I had the litter too high in the box and Kep his little piss cannon and his little butt goes up in the air. Uh, he shot into the corner and he peed uh, down the wall and it actually got the carpet wet and um, it was so bad that we got rid of the carpet. So since then we have not had anything in there. It's been a few months and um, I've been dealing with walking in there and having litter all over my feet and I vacuum it but I mean it's... They're in there so much. They're in there so much that it's back to the way it was in just you know two days. So I've wanted to get something for in there and um, Mal did a, a little research and found this thing and uh, I it's, wanted to get something else, but like for the size we want, and because of how far they jump, like we needed something bigger, and the thing we wanted didn't come that big. Yeah, they have a thing that's like, it's like a tray. The black hole mat. Yeah, the black hole mat. But for what we needed, it was we'd have to get two or something, and they're mm -hmm. already really expensive, so this is a better option. This is the Gorilla Grip, <laughs> as the cats are going to, you're, you're going to have a fight on the mat. It's not a, res a wrestling ring. Sagan likes it. Yeah. I mean, that's good that they're not, like, afraid of it. They're going to put on a little show for everyone. But it has little grooves in it, so the litter actually gets caught in it. And the idea is that you just pick up the mat and, you know, shake it outside. And it's also uh, waterproof. So if And you can, like, spray it with a hose. Mm -hmm. So in the event that, you know, somehow they do piss on it again, um, it'll be easily cleaned, which I think is really important. Yeah, they, uh, they play rough. Sometimes they play nice. And other times they, <laughs> they play really rough. He's just looking for an open... There it goes, I was going to say, he's just looking for an open spot. Kicking in the head. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Um, we'll have the full review of all of these meals in the pretty near future because we need a few left, but um, we'll talk more about that soon. Thanks for watching, and as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?